we uh, began the conference, there were several hundred people already gathered uh, with us. There were 150 people who uh, had come the day before on Tuesday because they, uh, they didn't want to miss anything. And then uh, as we came through the conference, we had such a wonderful attendance. And the final uh, count for the conference was 650 pastors and evangelists and church planters, along with all of the workers from the GOA uh, organization, uh, the total of 650. What a remarkable turnout it was. My names are Rebecca Wanjala. I'm saved. Come from Bungoma West. I am with the Antioch Grace Ministries and uh, Bishop Wasilwa. I'm a grandmother of 10 children. I've learned a lot what Dr. Dosset has taught us, and I believe that I'm going to start from my house. The main thing is to make the roots of my children, my grandchildren, to grow, to bear good fruits, and grow and be good Christians. I bless the name of the Lord because of, and I send my greetings to his children, three children and three grandchildren, and uh, save journey up to America. I also have grandchildren at Atlanta. I know they will receive the message in Jesus' name. I am Chungaji, Noak Boyd Misui, Kutoka Eneo La Rift Valley, Iki Wandio Kiunguzi, Wa Eneo Iyo, Kanina Udumu na Kanisa La Glory Outage Assembly, Na Tuko Eneo Iya Bungoma, Wa Ajili Mafundisho, Najua kwamba yale ambayo tumepata eh, kwa siku hii tatu itakuwa ya manufaa kwa ajili ya kazi yetu ya utumishi na tumeona mambo makubwa sana kwa mafundisho hii yale ambaye tulikuwa tunahubiri kitambo tulidhani kwamba tumejua sana lakini kuketi chini ya mafundisho tumepata mambo mengi na mimi najua kwamba tunaenda kubadilisha mambo mambo na mahubiri yetu itaenda kuinuka kuwa, eh, kuwa katika kiwango kingine Na shukura ni kwangu ni kwamba asante kwa ajili ya wale ambao waliusika kuunda e, mafundisho hii. Kwa majina naitwa Ruth Simiu, toka Chuele Bungoma, Family Blood Outreach Ministry. Kwa seminar ambayo tuko nayo, kwangu pinafsi nimebarikiwa, ninasimamia wa mama. Na nashukuru kwa haya mafundisho, kuna mambo mazuri ambayo nimeyapata ya menisaidia kama mama na yambayo naweza saidia kwa mama wenzangu kama wale ambao tunalijua neno la Mungu jinsi tunavyosimama katika huduma jinsi tunavyo oh, fundishana na kuchukua muda kwa ajili ya masomo jinsi tunavyosimama na kueleza yale ambayo ume message ambayo uko nayo katika andika ambalo uko nalo kwa ile siku hauwezi amka tu na unaanza kuhubiri pasipokuwa na mwelekeo kupita kwa seminar mimi nimebarikiwa na nimejua ni nini ambacho ninatakana kufanya kama mama katika ministry ambayo ninayosimamia basi kwa majina ni Dorcas Mwakula anatoka katika kanisa la Kamnyole Glory Outreach Ngoma region Nashukuru sana mafundisho ya siku ya leo maana hakika mimi nilikuwa mchungaji kwa muda lakini naona mafundisho ya leo inaenda kunipatilisha inaenda kunisimamisha kwa msingi ambayo ni thabiti kwa hivyo nashukuru sana Dr. Oin ambaye ametuletea hii mafundisho pamoja na Bishop Takana wacha Mungu awainue awabariki Christopher Barasa from Vive Ministry Chuele my pastor uh, this um, seminar has actually brought some attention to my work. I've not been trained before, so I've now gotten the framework of how to go about the God's work. We used not to have the framework, but now, but now we have got the, the framework, the way to preach, and how to convert the soul to the work of God. Kwa majina naitwa Pastor Kevin, na ubiri kanisa la Hope Center, Palace Kusi, 
na ningependa kushukuru Mungu kwa ajili ya mafundisho ambayo tumeweza kufundishwa leo kuanzia juzi na hakika nimebarikiwa na pia nimepata mwamko mpya na najua ya kwamba mwaka huu unaenda kuwa mwaka wa mabadiliko na wengi wanaenda kujengeka kupitia hayo mafundisho so ninashukuru sana na pia wengi wetu najua ya kwamba tumebarikiwa amen my name is Pauline Akinyi Nyatunge from Siaya County, uh, from Glory Outreach Assembly Church, representing uh, Ogoria in uh, Nyanza region. Yeah, I've been so much blessed in this conference, in this seminar. Like I've learned the four A's, accuracy while preaching, uh, accountability. I preach with authority. Uh, everything I encountered and endured through those flights was well worth it for me to get here and to enjoy this time with these men and women and to be able to co communicate the truth of God's word with them. You know, God has, has done a good work here. And I believe with all my heart that uh, much um, glory is going to come to the Lord from this conference. There's going to be some great things happen in Kenya as a result of us persevering and making sure that this conference took place. So I, I thank God for the privilege. I thank God for the opportunity. And I am so grateful to the people here in Chuele and the surrounding areas who were faithful to come and who have treated me so well. Thank you and God bless you. I love you and uh, pray that Kenya will be revived uh, in the days to come.